horrible news about Javante Williams. Broncos country is not happy that Melvin Gordon will most likely be the ball carrier. But then they go out and they sign Latavius Murray from the Saints. He had a <laughs> touchdown while they were in London this past weekend. Um, he ran for 57 yards for 11 carries and again that touchdown. So he is back. He was on the practice squad. They brought him up. Last year he was with the Ravens. He had 501 yards with six touchdowns. What do you both think about this? How are you feeling about Latavius Murray coming in to the Broncos squad, Jake? You know, he was a pro bowler with the Raiders mm -hmm. in his second season uh, after being a late round draft pick. That was also eight years ago. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, <laughs> you know, that Ravens offense last year was pretty uh, – it did not live up to the expectations and it's because they had so many running backs that got hurt right at the start of the season. Um, they still ended up with a pretty good running game because their quarterback is historically one of the best runners in the history of the NFL. Mm -hmm. So Latavius Murray, it's hard to judge what he did last season. He has been good when he's been called up sporadically over the last two seasons for practice squads. However, again, he's 32 years old. He's never been quite that good of a receiver and I'm not sure what we're really going to expect. Uh, I think he's clearly behind Melvin Gordon on the depth chart and maybe behind Mike Boone, particularly for this week. Um, so it, it's nice to have a body. It's nice to have somebody that knows what they're doing, but I'm not expecting much out of Latavius Murray. Um, Latavius Murray is a professional running back with a lot of tread on the tires. And uh, it, it, we're running backs like him. If, the play is designed for five yards. Can you get six or seven yards? If it's, you know, at the goal line for one yard, can you get over the line or maybe two or three? The question with running backs is can they see the hole and react to it quick enough? Now, you're not going to get a game breaker. You're not going to get somebody who's going to go for 50 or 60 yard runs. It's just not going to happen. But, you know, this is, this is, the, this is where we're at. And very likely the Broncos will be drafting a running back I mean, eventually, when they eventually have a draft pick next year, and, and I, I feel my heart is broken for Javante Williams because, from what I understand, it's, it's not just an ACL. It's, 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 it's like kind of um, the worst of the worst type of knee injuries in terms of recovery rates and success in recovery. So I just feel terrible for him. Um, and this is the guy, if Melvin Gordon – listen, Melvin Gordon's going to get a shot, guys, okay? He's going to get a shot. So we'll see. I mean, he's got it. He's going to be the starter. I wouldn't have done this, by the way. I would have already moved on from Melvin Gordon. I wouldn't have taken this chance. But he will be the starter. They will hand him the ball 16 to 20 times on, um, on Thursday night. If we're here for redemption stories, fine. But you, you got to figure he's going to fumble the ball eventually. I mean, that's all he's done. Mm 